Hey guys, so Britney Spears posed naked one more time. <laughs> she posted a few naked pics on her social media account on Instagram where she has more than 40 million followers. So I don't know what causes Britney to do that, even though uh, I, don't, I don't see much of Photoshop on these pictures and I think she looks great. If you want to see, go to her uh, Instagram page for her age. She looks all right, I would say. And it happened uh, at the moment when her ex, Semasgari, gave an interview to people. Uh, I mean, what else can he do, though? We all know about this guy only because of Britney Spears. Never heard of this guy before. I'm not gonna hear much about him later, I'm sure about that, unless something happens. That's what happened uh, to her previous uh, husband, ex-husband, Kevin Federline. I mean, uh, we only hear about him because um, of their kids that they have together uh, nothing special about this too um, and i don't know why britney chose to be with them like probably because they were attracted to her nothing else um, and in my opinion that's my take that they were attracted to her fame and money unfortunately for britney she cannot choose perfect guy for her so Sam Asghari told people during an interview earlier last week that he's never going to talk badly about britney it was a blessing to be able to share life with someone for a long time and people grow apart and people move on, the actor informed the outlet. Shortly before his 30th birthday, which took place on March 3rd, oh, I'm sure he's making money on these interviews and uh, I'm sure he's making money uh, out of his divorce. That's how it is. I mean, uh, sometimes I'm too cynical <laughs> and know that uh, I think a lot of things that going on in the world, in celebrity world, where like millions of dollars around these people it's all about money like 70 80 percent it's no true feelings especially in this case it's all about uh influence it's all about money it's all about fame and popularity i've always hated people leaving a certain relationship and at some point they told each other they love each other and they sat at the same table and ate food together so i never understood when people part ways and they talk badly about each other sam continued that's something I'm never going to do because I had nothing but an amazing experience and a great life and that's always going to be part of my life, a chapter of my life. He's later added, I always have the most positive mindset about life. My experiences in life have shaped me into the man I am today. All the right words, I mean, uh, I think like uh, that will give him some popularity or fame. Uh, you know, press love scandals. So, if they paid him to, to, to take his interview, they're not gonna pay him again. And now, again, I'm like cynical about these things, but um, I don't see any other reason uh, that Sam married Britney and then divorced her. And I heard some rumors, it's only rumors, you know, that he wanted uh, her to pay him out uh, after this divorce. So, I don't know, maybe Sam is not the bad guy that I'm trying to imagine him to be, but um, it looks like it. He says, continue, uh, I will continue growing. I come from a place where we celebrate our past. I look back fondly. My past was a blessing and beautiful. Um, Britney also had sweet words for her ex um, and not only called him a gift from God. I have an appreciation for how stable he is. I love that he doesn't even drink. The chemistry with us in the beginning was insane. We couldn't keep our hands off each other. Britney also had revealed how Sam had been by her side as she fought to end her 13-year conser conservatorship. Um, you know, she enjoyed this relationship and um, again, maybe she's she feels better now as he is. So sometimes you also like, um, uh, you know, when we all blame um, Britney's access for chasing money and fame with her, but she also enjoyed parts of this relationship even though I think relationship with Kevin Federline was definitely a mistake because she was still um, like at the top of her fame uh, she could have dated anyone that she wanted to but she chose a guy who's basically I don't want to say like any harsh words that he was basically a loser but he kind of was though and uh, when he decided to uh, go to court and uh, ask money from Britney it was a little bit too much I look up to him, his consistency with working out and being a good man, and being healthy and taking care of me and helping me learn how we can take care of each other. He's such an inspiration and I'm grateful. I don't know what happened between them. I don't know why they divorced, but apparently 
she feels alright and she can only say good words about him. Even though I think for him it was just a, you know, when you're an actor that nobody knows of and you wanna become great, uh, probably nothing can stop you in the in that pursuit, right? And uh, if along the way you meet in person that's super famous, has a lot of money, I have suspicions that uh, Sam wanted to use her, but it's only my suspicions. It's only alleged. I don't know the truth. Probably we'll find out pretty soon. Uh, even though Britney has only good things to say about Sam, Sam has only good things to say about Britney. It's, it doesn't look like a typical messy divorce that we see nowadays. So, I mean, at the end of the day, let's leave this at the positive note. Let's discuss what do you think about their relationship? Do you think uh, Sam was honest? Or do you think he wanted to use her? Let's discuss. And uh, you know the drill. Like this video, share this video with your friends. Uh, subscribe to the channel, turn the notification button. That's actually help uh, the channel to grow because YouTube sees that and uh, it starts promoting the videos. Thank you again for watching and see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.